une jolie fille, Sarah. Sarah, bien Salut. Salut, comment vas-tu Ça va très bien. Vraiment contente de te revoir. Merci. Alors, on va commencer, on va commencer en anglais et, et tous les gens qui connaissent euh, Serge Bertin, uh, welcome to HaitianJonas.com. It is a pleasure for me to be here with you um, after um, seeing your hard work um, representing Haiti. Um, to, you know, every map you go, you represent Haiti. Um, I, I remember the Spanish channel I was watching. It turned like it just like it was a beauty. Um, the stuff that you went through, uh, family. You don't want to go there. It's a sad moment, but you still represent Haiti, and we. I mean, we owe you that. So this is an honor for me to be here with you. And you can tell the people well, who is South Belt. Well, actually, first of all, it's an honor for me to represent Haiti. It has always been a dream to represent my country. And thank God I had the opportunity to do it. And I will always do it. Even though if I'm working as a lawyer, I'm a, as an actress, as a model, whatever I'm doing, I will always bring Haiti with me because Haiti is in my heart. And I will always have my flag on, the, on top. So the reason why I take Haiti everywhere I go is because I feel that people need to know that we Haitian are proud. We're proud of our nationality, we're proud of our culture, we're proud of everything we have. So, me, Sarah Bertin, I'm the 2010 Miss Haiti. I'm also a Hispano-American beauty queen, and soon I have to give back the crown. <laughs> right now, I'm an actress. I have been, I just filmed my fourth movie with Sci-Fi Channel in, Uni in the United States. It's named Sharktopus. I'm here in DC, also premiering a movie, One Night in Vegas. You all have to see my movies because they are great. I'm not saying it because it's me. I'm just saying that they're good movies. And they need to support you, give back yeah, to you. Of course, you have to support me, support Haiti, because everywhere I go and everything I do, people know that it's Haiti. It's not only Sawad, it's a Haitian. So I represent you guys and I, I want to thank you because I do receive a lot of support from all my Haitian friends all over the world, in Haiti, India, all over I go, any place I found Haitian, they're always very supportive and they encourage me to continue and to be bigger and to do more for the country and really that fulfills my heart. Nice. There are a lot of, um, usually on Facebook, YouTube, they always say, who's Haitian? And it's yes. you like, you know, all type of Haitian, they don't know when they don't, yeah. when they haven't been to Haiti. So it's been written. Um, there's something is different, for, I mean, in you. Um, you love people, you love kids. Tell me about your foundation that you have well, in Haiti. Actually, I have been working with kids since 2002 with other foundations. One of them is Hands in the Streets in the Dominican Republic. They work with kids with... HIV and kids with nutritional problems. So I've always felt involved into helping other people. But after Miss Haiti, then people start being interested in what I'm doing yeah. and they start <laughs> noticing that I do social work. So I created my foundation because there's a lot, all the people that support me, all the people that are there to back me up, I want them to know what I do so they can do the same. I believe that if I'm a role model for some girls, then they should see a positive role model in me. So that's why I, I started posting the pictures of what I'm doing. I started posting the pictures of my work with the kids. I do work with an orphanage, Le Bossa Maite in Haiti. We have 105 children. Nice. And I have been working with them now for three years. So we help them with their education, health, and also with the food. It's, I love the kids. I just love them and I really do it with my heart. Hopefully one day I will have more possibilities so I can do for more. For the moment that's what I can do. And I'm working on some other projects. As you know, with my foundation, my first project was the calendar. But my calendar, I did it for the benefit of winning money for the foundation. And with the first calendar, we gained almost $60,000. We gave it all to the foundation. Now we have the land. And our project is to build a technical professional school for the orphans in Haiti. So we're doing all the paperwork. You know, it takes time. I understand. We have to be patient. But we're working on it. And hopefully, I, 
I really want to start this year. A person like you doing a great job like this, and that's the reason why that um, Haitian Jonas is not about getting the fame, but it's just like a lot of people, a lot of um, people behind the scene, like great actors or singers, they're doing positive work, but people yes. never ask them questions. What can we do for you? That's the question um, we should put on the table as old as I get. Well, I swear it's the first time someone <laughs> asked me something yes. like that, and I'm so happy you do. Yes. Of but, course, we want to do a lot for our country, but the only thing we need is support. Yes. Because when we have a presentation, when we have a new movie coming up when we have something coming up when people see that our people support us other people from other countries respect us you know what it is because if I'm Haitian I represent you all over the world people see also oh, what you got Haiti ambassador is a bon volonté and represent Haiti she represents her country very well when they see that I'm, I have as a backup a whole country and the whole country is supporting me then they respect and they say Haitian are, are united Haitian work together. Haitian are worth it. Let's go to Haiti. Let's visit. And that's what we need. We need people to understand that our culture is a very friendly culture. <laughs> we help each other. We support each other. And we need them to know that they will feel comfortable if they come to our house. Now, since we are close, I want to tell you, I want to ask you, how can they help your foundation to get there? Well, actually, if you are willing to help the foundation, giving us time or helping us economically, you can contact us at www.sarajforapurpose.org. Sarajforapurpose.org. Or also at info at sarajbertin.com. We answer the emails, or most of the most of the I answer them personally. Nice. So if you have any question about the foundation, about the project, or if you are interested in to help in the project, you can contact me directly through these emails and we'll stay in touch and see how you can really help. Because some people don't have the money to help, but they can help with other things. They can help with time. We have they the money. Time. We have the money. We've been playing a lottery, illegal lottery. You know, we always lose yeah. money. So why don't we help the kids and help that's, that's one of the things I've always said. Because, believe it, I'm a person, I'm comfortable, my family have gave me a lot of opportunities and I thank my father for working for that. But I don't have everything in my life. Still I don't have everything I want, but I'm working for others. Why am I doing it? When you go out to a restaurant and you spend $100 dining, you spend $200, you can just go one day less to the restaurant a month and then you help like five children with 100 or 200 dollars so it really makes a difference um i know it's we don't have that much time we have to receive an award size button i would like to say thank you and the last question we're gonna keep it and people can follow up with us okay thank you so much big kiss to all of you you know i love you from the bottom of my heart big kiss to you to my friend thank you for the support